Well, hello there, old man Steve. You know, I live in I live in Texas, and and the heat is just really it's that it's that time of the year. It's supposed to be hot, but in August usually it gets up in the hundreds, and it has been hundred degrees for a plus. So you just don't want to go out, or if you do, you want to go out early in the morning before it gets too hot. So I didn't make it out early this morning. I goofed off and did piddle, you know how you piddle around, do little insignificant things around the house, you know. And uh, before you know it, the morning's gone. But anyway, I've been I've been uh, binge watching a bunch of British detective shows, where, which uh, I find fascinating, and they they talk funny. Of course, I guess they, if they were to listen to me, they'd think I talk funny too, but, <laughs> you know, and they say they, they don't call them the policemen police, but they call them coppers. They're called coppers, which I think in itself is funny. And um, I don't know, they just have funny expressions and I get amused and, and sometimes some of them are really hard to understand because uh, they talk so fast and they have that, I guess it's, what's it called, Cockney accent, and it's really thick, and uh, you have to really listen. You you develop an ear for it, I guess. After you listen, after you watch those shows for a while, you you, you get more used to the accent. But I enjoy them, and uh, I've been binge watching a whole bunch of them. Um, it's just what I've been doing because it's just too darn hot to go out and I don't know if it's like that all over the country but I know it is here in Texas and also that reminds me if you have a relative or a neighbor that's elderly like me check on them make sure that they've they've got their air conditioning working or if they need something from the store maybe they can't get out I'm lucky I can still get out and do things on my own, but there's a lot of people my age that can't. So you need to check on them. And, and it'll, it'll make them feel good. It'll make you feel good, too. <laughs> oh, you know, there's been a lot of talk about gaming and doing games on computers and stuff. I remember when I was young, we used to play games a lot, but they were board games, you know, like Monopoly. And those those games are still around, and they're a lot of fun. Not only is the game fun, but you interact with people. There's other people to talk to and all that. It's, you're sitting in front of a computer playing a game. You're just, well, you're just there by yourself. Uh, I don't get the attraction, but I know that there's a lot of people that do, and and if that's what you like to do that's fine but every once in a while you should play some board games with your friends and and that way you not only do you, you play the game and enjoy yourself you you talk and you visit and you learn stuff about each other and it just makes you feel better well that's my opinion and what do I know I'm just an old man <laughs> rattling on <laughs> as I usually do <laughs> oh well well y'all have a good day okay and stay out of trouble bye